Welcome back. Today we're going to talk about installing the Xamarin tooling on Visual Studio for PC. So I'm going to assume you already have Visual Studio installed. If you don't, head out to visualstudio.com and install it. Next up, you're going to see a Visual Studio installer prompt. So go ahead and start it up. And then if you have already underneath the workloads for mobile and gaming, if you happen to have the little Zamagon checked, you have it installed. If you don't, check it and install it. That's it. It'll install then. So we'll fire up Visual Studio and I just want to show you a couple cool things that ha happen then. One thing that you want to notice is that underneath the tools menu is that there's options at the bottom. And at the very bottom of the options, there's a Xamarin node. And underneath there is Android settings. And there's two options here that you want to take note of. The first one is auto install Android SDKs. And this is neat. So if you need any Android SDK options, it's going to automatically download them for you. So you have them when you need them. The other one is archives location. And that's going to tell you where the Android SDKs are installed for you. Great. Now, there are a couple other options I want to show off here for Android. And the first one is the Android SDK Manager. And what that does is it installs various SDKs for you. Android is notorious for having a ton of SDKs. And you don't need all of them installed. So what the SDKs do is that they install certain API versions. So right here, I just have Android 8.1 and Android 9.0 installed. And the other thing that you want to make sure you have installed here is the Android emulator. And so what the Android emulator does is that it's the tool set that lets you run on your computer rather than on your device. It's an emulator. And so the very last thing I want to show you about installing it is going back to the tools menu, Android, Android device manager. And so the device manager is the thing that lets you install Android emulators. So when this comes up, all you need to do is click New. Then it gives you various options on what to create. So here I'm going to build mine based off the Pixel 2 device and which operating system I want to create it off of. So let's say I'm going to create it off of Android Oreo 8.1. And then all I need to do is click Create. And there I, am. I have it. It's downloading it right now, creating, and when it's finished, I'll be able to run my Android apps on this brand new emulator. And that's it. Visual Studio has the Xamarin workload installed, and we're ready to go. In the next video, we're going to actually start building up a Xamarin application using Xamarin. Check it out.